Hello friends, welcome. In this video, I'm going to add a link here to the, when we have a title, add the link and when we click, we go to the movies slash the ID. I'm going to add the ID to the movies and there display the movie details. But first we don't have the ID. So if I go in the app.js, we get the data of a movies from this API. And if I copy and paste that API here, we can see we have only the title, the year, runtime and poster, but we need also the ID. And when we go to get a specific, a single movie. So for that, I'm going to create a JSON server. So here in our project, I'm going to create a new folder and I'm going to name it database and inside there a new file db.json and here I'm going to say movies is going to be with the movies we get from this API so let's select all copy and close now and paste it here and if I save now we need to run this to get to give it a URL. So let's open the terminal and create new terminal. Okay. And run npx JSON server and watch that file we created. So watch the database slash db.json. Okay. And I'm going to add a flag for the port to be 8,000. Hit enter. And now if we go in this URL, we get the same movies. So let's paste that in. Yeah, now let's add also the IDs here. And I'm going to say ID is going to be one. Let's copy this and do the same for the rest. So here is going to be two. Here is going to be three, four and five. And also, so let's add five here. I'm going to add the poster from this one to the last one because we don't have save good and of course if i come here and refresh we get now the ids very good now we need to change the api here so i'm going to copy this one and paste it here paste it save and let's go and refresh everything works correctly and you can see we have also the poster to the last one, which is the same as this one. Say lion. Yeah, good. Now we need to add a link here and we need a page to display the single movie. So also we need a route first. We need a route and let's, but to have a route, we need a, a component. So inside the pages, I'm going to create a new one and I'm going to say movie details dot JSX. And here I'm going to copy what we have in the about and paste it here. Change the name from about to be movie details like this. Save for now, for now as it is and import up here so i'm going to say import movie details from pages movie details and register new route so here save and i'm going to say i'm going to say movies slash and for id for the id we need to say colon and the id and we need to 
add the movie details here. The element is movie details. If I save and let's go now to the URL and say movies slash one, we are in the movie details page. Okay. Now we don't want to go like this, but we need to go from the when we click here. So we need to go in the components, movie card. Here we have the movie card. Here we need to use the link. But first we need to import the link from the React Router DOM. So import link from React Router DOM. And here when we have a title, I'm going to say link. So the not poster but back ticks here and slay say movies and movie ID because we have that movie in here okay we have the movie here or we can say directly distract the ID and say ID here. Now if I save as it is a refresh and uh, we need to add the link here, the title inside this link, so I forget. Okay, save it. And now as you can see, when you hover it, we get that uh, slash movies 3, movies 5, movies 4. Okay, but if I click, we go to this movie details page. Good. Here now we need to get the single movie based on the ID here. And for that, let's go to the movie details and we need to import first. the use state and also the use effect because we are going to get the we are going to make an API call and also we need to import the use params from the React Router DOM and as it is now here let's say const movie and also set movie is going to be use state and the initial value we know that the movie is an object so the initial value is going to be an empty object and i'm going to say also const params is going to be use params like this and here if I say uh, call the use effect and we need to add an callback function as you know and the because we need to call only once when this is going to render, I'm going to add on the empty array here. So it's going to run only one. It's going to call this use effect only one time for the first time. Here now I'm going to say just console.log. Not movie, but I'm going to say params here to see what we get. Okay, save it. Let's go and refresh, inspect element. And why I'm not going like this, go to the console. We have an object, which ID is one. If I ch change the ID to be two, enter, and you can see yeah, the ID is two. So we get the ID. 
Now how we can get the movie and assign here, we need to make an API call and we can do the same thing we have here. But uh, I'm going to create another a similar, but I'm going to use the async await so you can get, you can learn both. So let's say here, const, and I'm going to name it get movie is going to be async. And here I'm going to create a const result, which is going to be a wait, a wait, not get movie, but we need to fetch now and add the back ticks. Let's go and copy this URL slash movies. Because here, if I just say slash one, we get the single movie, okay? So let's copy that, paste it here. Now, instead of hard coded to one, we need to add dollar sign and here params.id. Okay, you need so the params ID is one, so we get movies one, params ID is two, we get movies two. Okay, now let's say const data is going to be with await again and call the results JSON like this. Very good. Now we have the data, we need to set the movie. So let's say set movie with data. Okay, and after this, we need to call now this get movie method. So let's say get movie like this. And now let's display the title in here. We can say movie dot title with capital T because that's it how we can get. Now if I refresh this one, yeah, here it is. Okay. Let's display also the all the details or I'm going to copy what we have in the movie card because it's going to be the same. So let's copy what we have here and also the destruction copy and paste in the movie details. I think we have the return. I have copied the return. Yes. Paste it here. Save. And the link is not defined. Yeah, because we need to remove now the link. We don't need the link here. save and here it is now the single movie you can add another uh, style but for me it's okay so let's go back so let's go back to the home page and select this doctor strange we have a doctor strange let's select the john wick and we have the john wick okay friends that's it for this video. I hope you enjoy. If you like a content like this, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like the video, share with your friends and see you in the next project. All the best.